Hi, congratulations. Thank you so much. So how does it feel? First UFC win, debut, you know, what were the emotions exactly what you thought or was it bigger? You know, it feels amazing. I, uh, I was like, you know, you, you dream about the moment of like making your UFC debut. And uh, this was more than I, more than I dreamt of. Um, I, I loved every moment of it. I was like in the fight, I was like, okay, I gotta, I gotta play this one smart. I can't get wily with this. And uh, just, you know, stay, stay heavy and, and uh, you know, be, be smart on top. Don't be jumping for submissions. Don't be doing anything wily. I fit my, my uh, debut, you only get one debut, so I didn't want to waste that. I didn't want to lose, go home, you know, with the loss, that would break my heart. So I played it safe this time, and, uh, you know, I, I loved it. Was there anything about Kay that surprised you in there? You know, I didn't have any um, kind of judgments coming in. I, she took a year off, and uh, so I had no idea what, what to expect. Um, so I, I wasn't surprised by anything just because I didn't an anticipate it before. Um, so, no, but, you know, it was kind of, you know, fight as usual. So you said you wanted to kind of control yourself in there the first time. What yes. are we going to see for your next one? Ah, who knows? I, I'm probably get wild, like, do some stupid shit, probably. I don't know. <laughs> when do you want to come back? How soon do you want to be back in there? I don't, I don't know. You know, it, this whole camp, I was, um, I had only, only focus on, on this fight, and um, now that this one's over with, I, I can open my, my mind up to see what doors are open. But uh, I never put any thought on, into it and, until, you know, this moment after the fight's done. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, right here. Uh, I know you said you weren't uh, overly surprised by anything that Kay brought, but it seems like you said you expected you you, you didn't uh, expect a, such a grappling heavy fight. So, in your was the game plan for you to maybe keep it standing, or were you looking to keep it standing? I mean, a little bit. Like it was like uh, be smart for me for how long I am to to use my range and and keep it standing. But I felt good in the grappling, so I was like, yeah, well, you know, why not? Let's let's grapple. Why not? And we couldn't really tell, but were you talking to her in there? Yeah, a little bit. You know, make it fun. Why not? Uh, you, she she caught my kick, took me down, and I was like, ah, oh, shit. You know, I'm here now. Uh, but I'm like, okay, I've been here before. Stay calm. Let's get out of this mess. And then I get on top, and I, I think I said, like, ooh, now we're in trouble now, baby, or something like that. I, I don't know. It was in the moment. <laughs> Did you agree with the stand-up in round two? The referee stood you up uh, from that grappling exchange on the canvas. I don't know. If, you know, whatever. If, if the ref wants to stand me up, I don't. I don't care. I didn't. It, it happened. I don't. It was like in one ear out the other, uh, onto the next. I, whatever. <laughs> hey, Jasmine, back here, yeah. right over here. Ah. Hey. Um, I think there was a bit of a question if uh, flyweight is the right weight class 4K. How did she feel in terms of her strength out there and the shots that she was throwing at you? I don't know. Well, hey, that's her decision. She, it's, if she wants to stay at 25, she's, I think she's small for, for 25. But, I mean, it's her life, and she, she's got to make those decisions. I mean, I fought at 115 before. But I was happier at, at 25. That being said, I'm, I wouldn't be against going back down to, to 115 for the right opportunity. But I, 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 it's, you know, her life, uh, you know. How much happier were you that this fight did end up getting moved to this card and you got to enjoy an arena and fans and not a little apex for your debut? Oh, I was jacked up. You know, it's everything that you, you dream about. It's like in, your anticipation on what your debut is going to be. And like you imagine the lights, you imagine the fans, you imagine everyone like, you know, high five you as you're going to the cage. And you know what, I, I, obviously if I was at the Apex, it's still my UFC debut, so I would, I would be very happy. But you know, this is, this is even better. You know, two title fights on the card, and uh, like, you know, Brandon Moreno and I have become like closer. He, his crew and my crew, they're like friends, and I, you know, I really look up to him, and uh, to be on the same card as him is just a blessing. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Is it that
Thank you guys.